flags unfurled as more than 3,700 military participants from the South African National Defense Force, or SANDF, and U.S. military members attended the opening ceremony of Shared Accord 13. Having experienced uh, uh, the coordination, the cooperation, um, uh, the professionalism, we are on par with each other, and uh, we respect each other, and uh, there's so much... Uh, uh, coordination and, 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 and reception to each other. The biennial training exercise is aimed at increasing interoperability between the two countries while strengthening the tactical response and capability of the forces through situational training. This year's training scenarios include tactical live fire, a humanitarian event, an amphibious landing and harbor sweep, along with a multinational airborne operation. Very hospitable, very friendly, some good friendships have been formed. Uh, we've discovered that uh, many of the things that we do, uh, we do similarly in our two countries, and we look forward to the exercise to learn more specifics uh, from each other. A diverse group of specialized troops will exercise their military skill set for the next two weeks. These include light and mechanized military tactics, communications and technology specialists, medical and veterinary providers, as well as various enabling and support personnel. Reporting for Shared Accord 13 in Port Elizabeth, South Africa, I'm Sergeant First Class Faith Lauder.